This is a rice field. And these are all the rice fields in the Philippines, amounting to more than 4.5 million hectares harvested annually. But are these enough to feed more than 100 million people in the country? Rice is an important crop as food and as a source of livelihood. Rice provides 45% of the caloric intake of Filipinos, and more than 2 million households are engaged in rice farming. In the effort to achieve rice security in the Philippines, information on rice such as area planted, seasonality, yield, and pest injuries are necessary for decision-making and policy support. To generate this information, data are collected in several rice fields nationwide. Meet a data collector, gathering data on rice crop and field conditions, bringing along pen and paper, septometer, GPS, meter stick, tripod, and a camera. However, this traditional method causes delays and inefficient data collection that slows down the transmission of vital rice information to decision makers. So, how can decision makers get timely information? The Philippine Department of Agriculture collaborated with the Philippine Rice Research Institute, the International Rice Research Institute, and SARMAP to develop and pioneer a modern rice information system in the Philippines, now known as the Philippine Rice Information System or PRISM. PRISM uses state-of-the-art technologies to deliver actionable information on rice. Let us take you to some insider information on how PRISM works. PRISM integrates data from Information Communications Technology or ICT and from remote sensing, specifically using satellite images from radar imaging mission Sentinel-1, developed and operated by the European Space Agency. Sentinel-1 captures high-resolution synthetic aperture radar or SAR images day and night, regardless of weather condition. Now, meet our PRISM data collectors, trained in the conduct of modern and standardized field surveys. The data collectors are responsible for gathering accurate field data using only smartphones, thus increasing productivity and efficiency. Smartphones installed with apps and tools developed by PRISM partners are used to gather field observations, rice and non-rice area validation, leaf area index, crop health assessments, and farmer interviews. As of December 2016, PRISM regional partners have been monitoring 1,060 fields per season in all rice-producing regions in the Philippines. Data collectors submit field data to a centralized database for filtering and validation. These data are received by a temporary database server, then categorized by automated scripts before being transferred to the main database. This is where DA staff assigned as PRISM data managers and information managers come in. Within a limited period of time, PRISM data managers are required to check the accuracy and validity of regional data, as they are accountable for its quality, while PRISM information managers are liable for ensuring that all data used by the system are validated and all published information are within the standards set by the Philippine Department of Agriculture. Remote sensing experts use the data in classifying SAR images and assessing the accuracy of the maps produced. The process SAR images, along with weather, varietal characteristics, soil, and crop management data, are used to estimate rice yields using the ORISA crop growth model. PRISM produces mid-season forecasts and end-season yield estimates. Crop modeling experts validate the estimated yields against data from crop cut experiments and official statistics in all regions to assess accuracy. In addition to the regular monitoring scheme, PRISM takes its standards to another level in the event of extreme weather conditions. In such conditions, national or regional requests trigger damage assessments and ground truthing. When there's a typhoon on its way, PRISM checks scheduled sentinel acquisitions and, if necessary, orders additional satellite images to quantify the effects of flooding. PRISM rapidly produces maps of affected areas and provides accurate information on the extent of damage and production loss. Detailed damage report over a wide area is delivered within 10 days or less. Publicly available information including detailed maps of rice area, seasonality and yield, reports on pest injury and disease observations, graphs and tables showing the occurrence of pest injuries and diseases, yield, fertilizers, pesticides and rice varieties used, can now be accessed and downloaded by stakeholders and decision makers anytime, anywhere, using any internet-connected device 
So be sure to check out the PRISM website, www.riceinfo.ph, for regular monitoring reports and damage assessments. More detailed reports from national down to the municipal level are available to authorized project partners through its analytics page and through regular and special PRISM bulletins. Adhering to PRISM standard information pathway, PRISM ensures delivery of accurate, detailed, timely, and location-specific rice information in the Philippines that could aid in planning and decision-making. Backed by such information, programs and policies of the DA will be more targeted and effective in helping Filipino rice farmers increase their production, thereby leading the country towards achieving food security. Want to know more about PRISM? Visit our website and express your support to the project's transition and sustainability through our social media pages.